We welcome you here to a big night of fights. I'm Joe Tessitore alongside my ringside partner, Teddy Atlas. Looking forward to all the action today, and we're just about set for it. Glover's really keyed in for this one. You can see it as he makes his walk to the ring. Everybody's been waiting for these two to meet up. Now they do as round one is underway. Lover's not just loading up, he's landing combination punches like he did right there. Nice work on the right hand by Clover. Diesel's just punching air that time. His opponent was able to get out of the way. Able to get rid of that one. And now he brings the left hand upstairs. Putting his punches together, good combination by Diesel. Frustrating his opponent with great defense. Glover's doing exactly what you should to be a strong defensive fighter. You gotta block those punches away. End of the round here, and as I glance around ringside and look at the judges, I'm wondering what they're writing down because that was a tough round to score. Yeah, it was, and you know, it's the kind of round where one guy would be really smart to take a page out of the book of Sugar Ray Leonard, Marvin Hagler, where Leonard stole rounds at the end, where he just clipped off 30 seconds, and that's exactly what the judges remembered. When you're calm in there, when you're in control in there, you can make him do what you want. He made him tie his shoelaces right there. Nice job doubling up the jab by Diesel. <laughs> Nowhere close that moving. punch by Glover. That's a solid right hand by Diesel. Teddy, I've heard you say it a million times early on in the fight. If there's any one piece of good advice you can give, you start depositing it into that bank. Go to the body. Yeah, because the interest comes later, and you're going to see the payoff in the late rounds. Blocks away that headshot. by Clubber. Thought he had his target, but way off to the side with the uppercut. Landing two jabs by Diesel. What a damaging blow. Nice hook upstairs. And made that nice right angle on that hook upstairs. Diesel's really in position to control things in this fight if he can do what he did just there, and that's land a good, solid jab. Woo! And we come to the end of the round. And you know his trainers got to love that because they stress, hey, go out there and be smart with what you're doing. He was very smart about when to throw and how to land it. And that's the key in the sweet science. Placing your punches, as you said, making them count. A good block. 
He took a shot, but he gives one of his own. A left hand scores. A little head hunting with the right. Parries that punch intended for the head. A well placed left hand up top. Good plus shot upstairs. Well targeted hook by Clover. Clover's proving to be elusive. Halfway through this round here. Hook on the inside. And now he's acting like a fighter. Coming back with the right hand after getting scored upon. Let's get some more head movement. Punch didn't come close. Straight right, left hook, very nicely done, scoring up top. That's the clean shot with the left hand that he was looking for by Clover. Clover's defense is now serving him well. Nice job blocking that punch. Brings the hook that time. Clover nailed by a huge hook. Diesel's putting forth that hard work he did in training camp there, landing a crisp combination. Final 10 seconds. Comes across with a hook up top. And the bell rings, signifying the end of the round. Well, we heard his analysis, but as for how Teddy has scored those first three rounds, here's a look. Keep so the hand about goes with a left hand. Lover's not firing off the big power punches. I got to wonder why. Sometimes a guy is making a solid agreement in his mind that maybe if I don't hit him hard, he won't hit me hard back. He's not confident enough now to throw the punches without worrying about what to come back at. Diesel showing you that sublime skill right now with that two-punch combo. Fine work with the left hand. He landed well by Diesel. He takes a shot and then commits to giving one right back. A crushing two-punch combo by Diesel. Sequence by Diesel. Lovers now feeling the after effects of being rocked by a huge hook to the head. Really fun looking fight so far here. We've reached the halfway mark. Teddy, your impressions as to what we're going to see in the second half of this fight? More of the same. I don't think these fighters know how to do anything, at least tonight. They came here with this mentality, and you know what? You can't really change gears at this point. You're going to see more of the same. Diesel's putting his punches together now. That's a nice combination. Unable to make an impact there by Clover. See him trying Move to in. cut down that tree with a well-placed right hand. <laughs> Lands flush with the two-punch combo by Diesel. A little head hunting with the left. on the wrong end of a destructive uppercut. Good job on the two-punch combo by Diesel. Diesel's winning these middle rounds here. He's doing so with infighting. And that's exactly what... 
what he envisioned when this fight started. He wasn't sure he was going to get it, but this is what he was hoping he would get. He's happy right now. Hey, keep your hands up. Oh, you see him with the left of the head there? On the mark with that hook by Diesel. Pulls the trigger right away with the left hand. That was a tag to the Lovers landing a combination here. That's what he does when he's at his very best. Comes right back at him with a left hand. Lovers on the bad end of a big hook upstairs. Listen, I'm not going to to action here at the start of this round which is just part of what has been a very evenly fought fight one of those fights that's going to be very hard to score oh a nice two punch combo by diesel clubbers is doing very nicely on the outside here in this fight It was the right. Diesel scoring with one of the most effective punches there is, landing an uppercut on the inside. Well, it's the right punch in the right place. The hands up of his opponent, but there's an opening right up that middle, split the guard, and the punch is the uppercut. That's the ticket, and he's going with it. Good effective work with that straight right hand. Not hitting his mark there, going upstairs. Scores with the uppercut. Wow, look at that training shot. A little give and take, and here comes the left hand. Diesel's the kind of boxer that wants to do just that. Find the target, get the combination working, land both punches. Committing to the body work now. He lands the right hand. Keep moving, working the jab. Took a shot. Now he gives the left. Good way to bring it back with the left hook after landing that right to the head. He really digs in when he decides to throw that uppercut. Good job. That's where you want. And it's a left hand. Okay. I don't thing. know, Teddy. It just feels move. like one of those nights. Head. One of those fights where somebody's right getting hurt. When you're where this is not going to the judges' scorecards. I feel like I'm in Coney Island watching one of those hot dog eating contests where somebody's going to try to eat 50 of them, 60 of them. In other words, he's not worried how he's going to feel at the end of the night. Diesel's keeping his guard up very, very well. Teddy, does it help to have the speed that he has? Uh, sure. Anytime you have speed, and you can put it into the equation where it's okay. whatever Pay you're doing, back. it has to be technically right, but now you put speed, you're doing it even better. You're doing it at a higher level. Scored well up top. Keep working the jab. Keep working to move it. Scores up top with a left. <laughs> Biting, snapping shot by Clover. Keep your back up. Keep your back up. How about that left Keep hand? That's a forceful two-punch combo by Diesel. He just missed that shot up top. Smart punch right there. The uppercut worked. Play by Schwaber. Right to the head with that right. <laughs> nice solid left hand scored by Clover. And now he's targeting upstairs. <laughs> he 
Diesel's head movement is really a factor in this fight. I mean, who would have thought it? Just one of the aspects of defense could be such a big key to this fight right now. Yeah, it is. And his opponent right now is not making adjustments. Matter of fact, he's starting to drown himself because he's going more and more head hunting. And the more he does it, the more he misses, the more frustrated he gets, the more tired he gets. He needs to make a change downstairs to the place that's not moving, down to the body. He missed with that head shot. How about a return to sender with the left hand? Able to land the hook to the head. Excellent one-two by Diesel. Diesel is on the bad end of a very impressive hook up top. Good return fire that time. Diesel's combination punching is working well here. Lover right the way that hook to the head. Oh, that has to hurt. Right to the belt line. Lover's so dangerous with that accuracy, a two-punch combination landing. Final minute of this round that has been nothing but two straight minutes of non-stop fury. Especially you see, Bell, more turbulence ahead. Diesel's left working well that time. Lover's inability to get away from his opponent's left hand is so evident. And it's going to stay that way if he doesn't change something. He needs to move the other direction, away from that punch. Well, he goes to the gut with the right hand. There's that proficient jab by Clover. Clover's right hand working well that time. He scored well. And Beautiful that's the work. end of round eight. Diesel's in dominating form here tonight. He's doing everything he wanted to do, and he's ahead on our scorecards ringside. Yeah, but don't forget, he's in the other guy's hometown. So don't let up too soon. Don't start partying too soon. You know, still keep doing the things you were doing to get you to this place. How about that? Another right hand. Not able to land the headshot. Nice work. The left hand to the head. Right to the body. Big great shots. He comes back with a right hand. Firing off the uppercut. Great exchange. There's a straight right hand. Right to the belt line. He saw the uppercut. He took advantage. Throwing it out there. Well, he told us he liked the infighting, and he's getting right to it. You know, he's getting a little bit of help, too. He doesn't really have to go climbing a mountain. His opponent's coming to him, setting him up really well. Clover's putting forth that hard work he did in training camp there, landing a crisp combination. Smart jab by Diesel. Banking away a body shot with the right hand. And now he brings the left hand upstairs. Final chance, last 10 seconds of round nine. Glover showing you that sublime skill right now with that two punch combo. There is hardly a doubt as to what this result will be. I know anything can happen, but all that's happened all night long is one guy punishing the other. Well, it looks like Kobe Bryant on a good night when that basket is 20 feet big. I mean, he just can't miss. That's a well-scored left hand by Diesel. 
Walker's gone into a defensive shell, but that shell has cracks in it. Yeah, it does. And the reason why it's getting cracked is because his opponent is confident that Move. with those earmuffs on, you know, going into that pickable defense that he is, he knows he's handcuffed. So he's putting together three, four, five punches where normally he would only throw one or two. One or something's going to come back. Who's on the inside? Diesel struck by a huge hook to the head. Comes with the straight right hand. Halfway through this tenth and final round. Great work offensively landing that combination by Clover. He worked it out really well. Throwing off the right hand after getting tagged like that. Right to the body. All right, here we go. Last 60 seconds of the fight. Takes one, gives one. The right hand scores well. Diesel on the bad end of a flush, solid hook. Tried to land that upstairs and was off the mark. Super two-punch combo by Diesel. And he returns on that exchange. Good defense upstairs to stay away from that offensive assault. That was a dominating performance tonight. Yeah, this is one you would think there's no drama in the reading of the scorecards. Let's hear those scorecards and send it up to the ring. That's a well-earned victory by Diesel. And it's nice to see.